you know, open dialogue, it's really important, not only with the United Nations, but also back home. Uh, there has to be a demonstration that uh, there is genuine dialogue. Um, uh, as the High Commissioner has said, there should be serious, credible efforts. I think that's the word that was used. Credible efforts to show that the government is addressing the acute impunity in the country prevailing right now. If there's an open dialogue, then uh, there should be an open invitation. There should be an open or standing invitation, let's say, for special procedures uh, to be able to come into the country and examine the situation. Um, uh, there should be uh, efforts to welcome uh, investigations and requests coming from domestic uh, mechanisms like the Commission on Human Rights when we request for information on uh, the investigation of uh, the deaths that have occurred. So there has to be um, a follow through. Uh, so um, non-interference is, is something that uh, we did hear the president saying that uh, he was aligning himself, uh, the Philippines, with uh, the ASEAN. It's a principle of ASEAN. but. Yeah. Uh, in terms of human rights, you cannot say that this is a domestic issue because uh, human rights is a universal issue. Um, uh, it's an issue about humanity, and uh, that's the business of the international community. We don't exist in a vacuum. Uh, we, we belong to the international community, and uh, there has to be engagement there as well.